In the fictional city of Marzipan, we find a young lad named Chowder, a master chef with a big nose, a fairy mother, a talking rabbit girl, and so much more going on in that city. This show was a 2007 animation produced by Cartoon Network. And in today's episode, we shall get to see the best eight characters who were most recurring in the show and how they live their day-to-day -day lives. And mostly we shall talk about their character and personalities. Then later we shall take a look at the people behind the beautiful voices and how they live and look in 2024. So sit back. As usual, let's first discuss the main boy, Chowder, who was an innocent and friendly child whose main desire in life was to be the greatest chef in Marzipan City. As a normal kid, Chowder was obese. He was a mixture of a cat bear and a rabbit who wore a long shirt that covered his legs. He was an emotional fella who cried more than once in the show. He mostly worked for someone called Mung and was his apprentice. Chowder loved eating all he could and also sleeping after he stuffed himself with junk foods. He also loved being with his friends in the kitchen trying different recipes and foods to cook. This adorable little thing was voiced by Nikki Jones, who is an American former child actor. Jones was born on July 1996 in Texas from a mother who was a news broadcaster and radio host. He has done some Cartoon Network voiceovers since 2005, shows like Bambi, Amazing World of Gumball, and most famously Chowder. He retired so early from the movies and is now currently 27 years old. Kimchi was Chowder's pet who appeared in the show as a supporting character. He was a stinky cloud who had the smell of fart, and no one wanted to be near him, except from Chowder, of course. He had no other friend, and always considered Chowder to be his best friend. They always played together whenever Chowder was free. Kimchi was voiced by Carl Harvey Greenblatt, who is an American animator and voice actor. He has worked with Nickelodeon in producing SpongeBob SquarePants and also took part in directing The Grim Adventures of Billy and Mandy. He is actually the creator of Chowder, Mr. Greenblatt attended the University of Texas where he majored in advertising and later worked as a cartoonist. His first job was actually working as a storyboard artist for SpongeBob. He is a successful man and is 52 years old today. Mung Dahl was the head chef of his company called the Mung Dales Catering Company. He was a really intelligent guy as he always had a new invention of food and his cooking skills were not so bad. We always saw him teaching Chowder how to cook and cater in the kitchen. And believe it or not, Mung has been cooking for over 386 years. He also had a wife who he's been married to for almost 450 years. He had a mustache, which he loved more than anything, and also had quite a long nose, which was hard to miss. Mung was obsessed with women, which always made his wife furious. This guy was voiced by the iconic Dwight Schultz, who is an American television and voice actor. He is best recognized as Reginald Barclay from the Star Trek franchise, and is also known for voicing Dr. Animo in the Ben 10 series. Dwight is of German descent and is a Roman Catholic in faith. Married since 1983, he is blessed with one daughter and is 76 years old today. Schnitzel was seen as an employee of Mung, who was always grouchy and according to the show was so underpaid. Mung loved having him as an employee because he was super strong and could do manual work with ease. His cooking skills were also very good and his food was so tasty. He was also used as a bodyguard and was actually intelligent. He always repeated one word every time he spoke, rata rata. And at the end of the show, it was so sad to see him leave the catering business to go and live with his wife. Patey, on the other hand, was just a minor character who appeared once in a while. He was a dancer, kind of like Michael Jackson, and had elongated eyelashes which were somewhat beautiful. These two guys had the honor to be voiced by the legendary John DiMaggio, who is an American actor and voice actor. John is everywhere, and I bet he is almost in 95% cartoons from Cartoon Network. Adventure Time, Ben 10, Kim Possible Paradise B, Futurama, Samurai Jack, Spider-Man, Aquaman, Disenchantment. I mean, John DiMaggio is everywhere. And only 56 years of age, I can say that John has accomplished everything in the voicing department. Truffles was the wife to Mung and was a fairy lady who helped in managing the finances of the catering business. Truffles was sometimes mean and scary, while at other times she was seen to be in a good mood and friendly to everyone, including Chowder. She was mostly insecure about her weight and always went nuts when anyone said that she was fat. She dominated her husband in everything, from their love life to their business. She, however, was actually good naturally and loved her husband so much, which is why she supported him in the catering business. The beautiful Truffles was voiced by Tara Strong, who is an American voice actress. Just like John DiMaggio, Tara Strong has done everything. Examples of her work include Teen Titans Go, Fairy Odd Parents, Ben 10, The Proud Family, Mortal Kombat, and the list goes on and on and on. Born in 1973, she is blessed with two kids and is currently 51 years old. Gazbaco was a woolly mammoth 
who worked as a fruit salesman in Marzipan City. He was friends with Chowder and was living with his mother. He was a middle-aged man who had no plans of moving out of his mother's basement and never showed any signs of improving his own life. He was mostly depressed and was seen more than once talking to himself in the mirror. He also had no romantic life and was not lucky with the ladies. Despite all that, he was a friendly guy and was so good with kids. He was voiced by Dana Snyder, who is an American actor and comedian. He was born in Pennsylvania and went to school in Las Vegas High School. He then studied in Webster University and then started rolling in small shows and cartoons. He is mostly known for his role in The Thundermans as Dr. Colosso and also in The Ghost of Molly McShee, also known as Carmen DiCenzo. Dana Snyder is currently 50 years old today. Honorable Mentions Panini was a young bunny girl who had a huge crush on Chowder and was always trying persistently to be his girlfriend. She was like 10 or 12 years old and was an apprentice of a chef called Endive, who we shall discuss later. She was so obedient and never wanted to let her boss down. She was voiced by a lady called Liliana Mummy, who is an American actress. Liliana is currently 30 years old today. And finally, we have Miss Endive, who was the boss of Panini and a master chef just like Mung. She was so snobby and arrogant and was the main villain of the show. According to censored sources, it is said that she was actually a better cook than Mung Dahl. Endive was voiced by Mindy Sterling, who is an American film and voice actress. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you in the next episode.